I'm Mimi. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much today for clicking on this video. This is my week 28 update and it is also the update for how my week went after I injected Mount Jaro in my arm for the first time. Previously, I've used the thigh or the stomach and I decided to try injecting in the arm because I saw on a few forums online, people saying that they have better results if they inject in the arm. It sounded pretty unbelievable to me, but I had nothing to lose by giving it a try um, and to see if it made any difference. Just to provide a bit of backstory, if you haven't followed my videos, um, I haven't really lost much weight in quite a while. Um, it feels like I've been on a bit of a stall. Um, this is partly because I've had some weeks where I haven't been able to get hold of Manjaro and I've had repeated, when I have had it, I've had repeated weeks on um, 10 milligrams when really ideally I'm, I'm ready to move up a dose. The previous three weeks have been at 10 milligrams and I lost half a pound those previous three weeks. Now my week after injecting in the arm had two surprising positive results. The first one is I'm going to go straight to the weight loss because that's what I'm most excited about. Um, I lost two pounds. I haven't seen a two pound weight loss since the first week in November. Um, ever since then, I think the maximum I've lost in one week has been a pound. Um, some weeks stay in the same, some weeks putting on and um, some weeks just losing half a pound. So to suddenly go back to losing two pounds in one week is a big, a big jump for me. Um, does that mean it worked? I mean, I certainly had stronger appetite suppression. I certainly have lost more weight than I have done in the previous weeks. Is it because I injected in the arm? No idea. Um, but there wasn't anything else that changed this last week. So from now on, I'm an arm injector. You know, I'm, I'm giving it giving it a go every week. Um, I would absolutely love it if you could put in the comments whether you have tried injecting in the arm and whether you lost more weight um, that week. Um, whether if you haven't tried it, please try it. You know, you've got to take part in this experiment. We've all got to see um, what happens. Um, I mean, my gut feeling is that it must have been a coincidence. Perhaps I was just ready to get um, over a bit of a stall in my weight loss. But genuinely, I don't know. You know, I, I, I really, really can't explain it. I am just going to, from now on, inject it in the arm. Which actually leads me to the other positive thing that happened after I injected in the arm. Um, many, many weeks ago, I talked about how I was getting a reaction at the injection site. Um, I did kind of cure that, um, but nonetheless, my sort of definition of having cured it um, was actually that it still always itched a little bit. I would still always end up with a red mark that would often be there for a good two weeks, sometimes longer. Um, you know, it was useful in that it actually could tell me where the, my last two injection points had been so that I didn't repeat. Um, but nonetheless, I had um, an irritation, albeit it was more mild than it had been previously. Um, with injection in the arm, I had no irritation at all. Absolutely none. Um, when I look in the mirror, I can see it's a little bit red. Um, but it doesn't doesn't irritate at all. So for anyone that gets an irritation at the injection site, um, I would suggest trying in the arm um, to kind of like look for a logical explanation for that. And actually thinking about it, I don't know why I didn't try it sooner when I've been having um, like a reaction at the injection site. Um, I think it's because on the arm, my clothes are basically not rubbing it. Um, whereas in the thigh, you know, I, I wear jeans most of the time. I've got my jeans on. Um, and obviously in the stomach, you know, it's, 
around my waist area. So there's obviously going to be an irritation from my clothes. So that is to me the logical difference. Um, but before I realized the weight was kind of coming off this last week, I was actually really, really excited that I had no irritation at the injection site. So I saw two benefits to injecting in the arm. Um, I had the best weight loss I have had in three months, um, which may or may not be connected. Um, and I had zero irritation at the injection site, which is enough of a, an incentive for me to continue injecting in the arm. Um, I, as usual, would love it if you could share in the comments your thoughts on this, um, whether you've tried injecting in the arm um, and you have also seen greater weight loss benefits or you didn't. Maybe there's a different injection site where you saw the most benefit. Um, maybe the idea that an injection site equals a different amount of weight loss is completely nonsense. Let me know if that's what you think. Um, and also whether anyone else who has had an irritation at the injection site um, also found that it was beneficial to inject in the arm, whether you had the same experience that there was no irritation. Um, but I have been super excited to share this update. I will um, share again um, how the arm injections are going, um, whether I continue to see a greater weight loss. Um, at this point in time, I have now had to take a few days off Mount Jaro. Um, I'm having a bit of a hiccup again with my pharmacy. So I am dealing with that right now i don't know when i will be injecting again and therefore i'm not sure when i will be updating again let's hope it's soon because because you know um so that's my update for today thank you so much for watching and i'm looking forward to reading your comments bye